Hey healthy people, Dr. Rubina here. Welcome to the RX. I'm joined by Jess, the founder of Eat Your Way to Wellness. And we want to talk a little bit about pink Himalayan salt. So I've seen a lot of this. Yes. I've tried it. But why do you want to replace this particular salt with regular table salt? So sea salt is one of the naturally occurring salts. It's also going to have more minerals than a regular table salt, and it's not processed or bleached. So it's a better alternative. Okay, mm -hmm. and so do we have to worry about you know intake of sodium with this product as well? You always want to worry about intake of sodium, but this is going to have a little bit less sodium. So mm -hmm. if your doctors put you on a restriction, keep that in mind, certainly. But you can use less of this and still have a saltier taste, I think. Okay, so mm -hmm. it will give you that like salty craving. Definitely, it will definitely soothe this, the salty tooth. And then how much of it do you want to add into meals? Like let's say you're working with chicken or meats. So I always wait till the end until I taste my meal, see how my flavors are, okay. and add salt at the end. That way I'm gonna get a salty coating in my mouth, mm -hmm. and I'm like, I can actually use less overall. Less overall, that's great. Mm -hmm. And so this is something you can keep at the dinner table. At and the it's dinner a, table. It's a great alternative. It's a great alternative. So healthy choices, that's what we're all about. That's all the time we have for today. Thanks for watching My New Philly, where something is always new, and, and everything, everything is always Philly. Philly.